When it's time to remove a power stretcher from the ambulance, there's a couple of simple steps we would like you to follow to be safe and efficient. A benefit to the power stretcher is that both responders are able to go hands-on ensuring efficient movement. So as we approach the stretcher, we're going to disengage it from the safety fastener. Head is up, shoulders are back, and with good mechanics and good communication, one, two, three, walk. We're bring the stretcher out, keeping it close to our bodies to ensure the core activates. As we hit the safety stop, we're going to lower the carriage down to the floor. Once the carriage is down, with good communication and moving through our hips, one, two, three, down. By following that approach, we're able to lower the stretcher using the strong muscles in our hips and glutes while keeping the strong muscles in our core engaged. That removes the strain on your lower back, ensuring safe and efficient patient handling. Mm -hmm.